Hey guys, this evening I'm going to be making a stool for my garage so I can sit down once in a while. And for this I am going to utilize my miter saw, electric miter saw. There's just too many uh, pieces to cut and uh, too many angles. cut now um, we're gonna plane everything and we're gonna assemble it okay this is my seat so I need to to uh, plane this because I don't want no there's a little round edge here I don't want that because I need to laminate this Alright folks, I cheated. I went on my bench saw and I put a straight edge on all the pieces to remove all the, the curves and the lumber. I just had too much to do. Two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve pieces. Now that I have a semi-smooth face with my table saw, now I can finish with the plane and get that, that the silky finish I want. Don't need much, just a little bit. Oh, what a difference. You just can't beat that finish. It's like satiny, nice satiny finish. Okay, I finished planning all the sides of everything. Wow, what a workout. I'm actually sweating quite a bit, so. Yeah, it's a workout all right. Get your cardio going. Okay, I just wanted to show you the that's the lumber from the mill okay when you buy it when you buy rough lumber that's what it looks like it's just awful so i want you to see the difference with with the plane Now you see that satin finish, I can't really get closer than this, but this is like satiny, silky, it's even shiny. That's the difference. All my faces and all my edges are all planed. So that's the layout I got. I'll have two of those. And of course the seat part, uh, which I still have to laminate. But uh, so that's what we get. My seat part is laminated and I'm just gonna let it dry. Once it's dry, I'm gonna plane it all even. I have some shavings for sale. Any takers? Well, I think it's time to put this puppy together. I was thinking screws, then I was thinking dowels. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use both. Right, right in the joints here, I'm gonna put in some long screws, two of them. And I'm gonna cap it with a dowel so it'll look like it's a dowel instead of a screw so that's what I'm gonna do
Yeah, my white boards, are pr uh, they, they're pretty curvy. They all bow in the middle, so I'm going to have some planing to do. I'm going to have some splaining to do. You get it? finish uh, sanding I had to fill out that that's the bench top right here there's really big big knots I had to fill them out and there's as many knots underneath so there wasn't not much I could do so I just filled them out it looks it still looks good so With the uh, adhesive there, by tomorrow that's going to be rock solid. So, so now all I got to do is put some Danish oil on there. have it when I have myself a stool for the shop all right guys well on this note that was another really cool project and fun to make and top it off I got myself a stool for the shop so we'll catch you guys in my next video